If you need help with a geometric sequence with nth term notation, one of our examples is given right here. I have a n equals negative negative 3 to the n minus 1. So with nth term notation, you're always going to have to plug in n. And we start with 1, then we go to 2, 3, and 4. Let's start with 1. That means that this n and this n need to change. So I have a1 equals negative, negative 3, 1, minus 1. Down here, again, this is going to become a 2. a2 equals negative, negative 3, 2, minus 1. Let's do it one last time. a3 equals negative, negative 3, with 3 minus 1. And then finally, a4 equals negative, negative 3, 4, minus 1. Let's go ahead and evaluate these. I'm going to skip a little step here, and I'm going to go ahead and simplify these things right here. 1 minus 1 is the same thing as 0. 2 minus 1 is the same thing as 1. 3 minus 1 is the same thing as 2. And 4 minus 1 is the same thing as 3. So now, basically, I have a bunch of exponents. I have negative, negative 3 to the 0. Negative 3 to the 0. Well, I know anything to the 0 is just 1. So now I have negative 1. Over here, I again have negative, negative 3 to the 1. Well, if it's to the 1, we just keep it the same way. So now I have negative negative 3. Over here I have a second power so I have negative negative 3 to the second power. Now this is the first one where I get to use my exponent really I have negative negative 3 times negative 3. How many? Two of them. And over here I have negative negative 3 to the third power so I'm gonna have three of these. I'm gonna have negative negative 3, negative 3, negative 3. So my answer here is negative 1. Negative, negative makes a positive 3. Negative, negative, negative makes a negative. 3 times 3 is 9. Negative, negative makes a positive. Negative, negative makes a positive. So my final answer is positive. 3 times 3 times 3 is 27. So my sequence is going to start, my first one, a1 is negative 1, a2 is 3, a3 is negative 9, and a4 is 27. And I could keep going if I wanted. There is a shortcut. If you want to do the shortcut, keep watching. I'll show you in purple here. What I can do is rewrite this. A n equals negative, negative 3, n minus 1. You have to remember the original equation to do this. A n equals a 1 d n minus 1. This is my general nth term notation for a sequence here. Now, this part of the sequence is my first term. So that means my first term is an invisible negative 1. So I start with negative 1. This part of the sequence is my multiplier. So I have to take negative 1 times negative 3. Well, that's going to give me a positive 3. Again, I have to use my multiplier. So I need to multiply by negative 3. Here I was multiplying by negative 3 as well. So 3 times negative 3 gives me negative 9. Again, multiply by negative 3. And I'm going to get negative negative makes a positive 27. So you can see I'm getting the same exact sequence 
negative 1, 3, negative 9, 7, by just finding my first term and then multiplying by my multiplier over and over and over. I hope that helps you out.